Yes. <laughs> my butt crack going. Yeah. All right. A little. It's Ronnie. A little bit. I had been thinking of leaving this business and becoming a plumber. <laughs> I've always liked crack, as you know. All right, let's see if this is working. The only nope. plumber I know became a Shit, no, fuck me. Uh, <laughs> kind of Towel, please. I'm trying to, I've just totally failed does everything. That, does that increase the price? No, it, it increases the tabernacle price, but it increases the price I have to pay to buy the piece of art I just so. Oh no, we made a clean spot. So the show is going quite well so far. We might have never started early. Okay. How much today? Why is it in this far when my hand feels slimy, I want to hold it in this position? Why is that? Is that too gross? Is everything okay? All right. For God's sake, so just all kinds of wrong here. Okay. That's wrong. Um, hey, I didn't put that bubble machine right in front of me. Alright, it's not my fault. Motherfuckers. The whole thing happened because this bubble machine is in use by other people. And they use a remote control and they plug the remote control box into it and then they don't tell me where the remote control is. Because I prefer to operate the bubble machine manually. I might get elected you. Okay, thank God. All right, we got that working now. Yeah. Okay. It just needs a little more bubble juice. Hang on, we're starting the show. Don't panic. I know there's only three people here. It does start at 10.30. It's on the bonus night. We're starting That's early, cool. and you're getting on early so you can get on, because you've been very, very nice to come to the show, but I know you've got to get on early, so I got you covered. That's an extra large. Just need more juice in the bubble machine. I put meat Are you not playing tonight? Is that what you're saying? No, I put a Oh, good. Okay. Well, the bubble machine isn't working very well, so we're off to good stuff. All right, what else? Reverend Angel Dust has t-shirts. I'll take a large. And remember, large. you can get them black on white printing or white with black printing. Both shirts are great. I see a lot of people wearing them around town. They're not quite as good as Occupy Pancakes t-shirts, but they're pretty damn good. They are hand illustrated by Michael Garvin, the Minister of the Interior who is about three years late with our new poster, Reverend Angel Dust. Oh, okay, got it. So, but the Reverend put great quality and, and research into the making of these shirts. This is the kind of shirt that you can wash more than once and still wear. Yes. All right. I like that. I love like washing shit. I can associate it with that thing. building longer than you have. You're saying, you got, you all wash shirts here? No, it's we a don't. lucky shirt. We got to keep the stage on here. Wash. Okay, next shirt, new shirt, Tabernacle. All right, uh, it's it's going to be a, a quote. It's going to be keep the stink on, and it's going to say no wash, and then that, uh, uh, you have to uh, attribute it to Purple Cloud. Making that physical. <laughs> yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Without further ado, oh, let me say what this is too. Oh yeah. Hans is a famous artist. You can look him up on the line. And he painted this live during our show. There's no talking here. And he painted this live during our show. And each time a person would come on the stage to perform, he would paint them into the picture. So now, Salino over at Soma Art Media Hub framed it in this cool wooden frame. And there's more to the frame. But anyway, he told me, bring it over here with Pons' permission and get anyone we can get who's in the picture to, in like small magic marker right there, name on the thing. And, uh, and you're in it. Yeah! Well, see, see the hat? See the hat? Look at the hat right there, see? Give her a hat. That's you. Well, anyway, you know, they're all impressionistic. But we'll get to that part uh, right after we do this. Ladies and gentlemen, it is an absolute honor and privilege, all the way from the first time I ever met you and saw you way back in the day at, uh, at the punk rock club, right? The Hardback Cafe. 
And what a beautiful man you are, what a friendship we've had, what great things you've done in the music community here, don't cry. I see you all over town, you're not fooling around, I appreciate you very much. And uh, now, we're just going to give the stage to the one and only Purple Cloud, ladies and gentlemen. How's everybody doing this evening? Yeah. 
one song that is it. I'm gonna make the most of that. 